We're at Playthrough 2024 with Finn, and we're showing off his Harmony system, their Harmony system. And from what I can gather, you said it's basically these Raspberry Pis, open source. You can use pretty much any camera, Definitely. from what I can tell. Yep. And what it does is it keeps track of all the stats of your games. Do you have a bunch of games that you've programmed so far? Or like right now, I know we're, we're just demoing uh, at what it would what work yeah, with right now, as Battletech. Right now, we're working with Battletech Alpha Strike because we're super fans. We are not Catalyst Game Labs. We're not Tops. We're not affiliated. We just love the system. Harmony is a rules agnostic system that we're using uh, Alpha Strike and our own internally developed space prison break game to showcase the features. Okay. It's a hardware accelerator that's supposed to take on the rigmarole of bookkeeping for tabletop gaming. If you're playing a game of Alpha Strike, it can take 20 minutes to play a whole turn. If you're using our system when everything's up and running and functioning perfectly, you can get it down to about five minutes, pick up and play your game. Okay, so, so you like pick up a piece, it show it to the camera, and say, and you somehow... So it's gonna keep track of that unit's stats, and so it doesn't matter what it is, it's gonna keep track of that unit's stats. We can uh -huh. tell the Harmony system, hey, this is a building, hey, this is a mech that can move however many inches. And so if you move the pieces in a way that is contrary to the rules that we've established for those pieces, the system's gonna let you know. This way you can just pick up and play your tabletop game without having to open up the rule book, without having to take all the time figuring out all the different rules. It's gonna keep track of your building health, and it's basically just gonna make it so you can play tabletop like it's 2024 instead of 1920. Okay, any particular types of games you think it would be good for, or? It's gonna be great for tabletop games like war games, tabletop games, anything where it's going to keep track of multiple stats and states for everything on the board. What about like Dominion or? Not familiar with that one, but okay. there is a uh, scary British company that makes a couple of famous games y'all might be familiar with that if anybody wanted to be brave enough to start adapting the rule set, we've created the uh, tools that can help you do it. Okay, so they just go to, uh, what is this, Linktree, Makerspace, find out where to download your software and all that kind of stuff? All open source, hosted on GitHub. How long does it take to um, program? Uh, um, a new rule set? A new rule set. Uh, you, like, because you could you could pick any game that you yeah. wanted, so and like it's, uh, since it's open source, like people can create their own library for a game that they like. So, like, let's say, like, um, like someone likes Gloomhaven, and uh -huh. they're, like really dedicated about that, they could just create their own rule set and then just import that into the system. Gotcha. So then, as the, since it's open source, we could put it on the Discord, share it on the, okay, these are the list of games we've already got programmed. Precisely. You were asking how long it would take to program a new rule set? Yeah. How good are you at coding? <laughs> oh. It's not even that. It's not no code, rule set, uh, description. Probably to describe chess might take about 30 minutes. Something more complicated takes a little bit longer. Chess would be 30 minutes. Something more complicated a little bit longer. Okay. So this, uh, this is something that as a community, we can take advantage yeah, of, exactly. and the more the more popular it becomes as a community, then it, we most, people, most yeah. people will never take the time to learn how to program and all that kind of stuff. But there's always a nerd like us. Yeah. <laughs> there's always somebody nerdier than us that wants to, that loves that shit, right? Exactly. <laughs> Good to go. Good to go. Well, thanks a lot, y'all. We appreciate it. We'll Thank see you on the next thanks one. For